it's been 8 years of our marriage and maybe we were just trying to plan a, to have the kids after 4 years of our marriage and when we were planning out and it wasn't working out we just consulted a gynecologist where uh, maybe after few tests and all she has revealed to us that maybe it's difficult for us to conceive naturally and you only need to depend on maybe artificial insemination and all so the doctor after trying to look into and scanning with all the reports and all she has advised us that we are left only with one option that is ivf and uh, we need to no uh, you know start the cycle right away if you are interested and we said okay fine we would go ahead and yes she has just tried out with us for three cycles within a span of one and a half year and uh, those three cycles are, were also based on our request because we did not want it to bother ourselves with our age you know to be a complicating issue later on so we just went for it for three times in one and a half year but none of the cycles clicked so it was through one of my colleague that i just came to know about durga ma'am and after Dur- meeting durga rao ma'am because we already had all the reports with us and all she had gone through everything and she just said yeah because you already had three cycles there's nothing much that uh, uh, i can brief you as you are aware of all the things that have worked down it's only ivf that we just could put you on but maybe after a month during these due course of uh, test you know some 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 somehow we felt we have missed out a point discussing with her and it was my about my husband that he is a dextrocardia that is right, maybe the heart is on to the right side that was the point where she could get a hold of us and maybe ma'am also has had some discussions with her team like dr krishna sir and all and maybe uh, they have advised us for few genetic test because she did not want that that would not be a issue actually that's not something which was bothering us but she said it would not be carried on to future generations few problems which may arise because of it and the test reports were just normal and she said now there's no hurdles for us and we need not you know wait for anything else we can directly go ahead with our you know plan so whenever you are ready we would go and we said we are ready immediately and she has immediately started as the treatment in the month of jan itself and maybe she found some polycystic uh, polycysts and also for which she just has carried out some small procedure on me and after that in the month of february she just started uh, the ivf cycle and all to the all happy ending it was a successful cycle so first cycle clicked us and uh, we were really happy but it is but for all the efforts as a team in the oas is that uh, maybe our cycle would haven't clicked so finally it was but for durga ma'am's meticulous planning and our whole team which has supported us a lot during us uh, during maybe 6 months of our journey here in oas is like dr krishna sir who has also given us a lot of emotional support dr varlakshmi ma'am who was with me whenever the scannings were taking place dr shilpi reddy who was also there and you know looking after few scans and all i definitely cannot forget the whole team of oasis